Hello, this is a demo of some of the main import features that RefTab offers. As long as you have CSV files, importing your data is pretty straightforward. So in this video, we'll start by importing our assets, then we'll import a list of loanees, and finally, we'll import our asset loans. So I'll start by clicking on Settings, then I'll click Import Export Data, Okay, in the middle of the page here is where we'll import a CSV file of our asset data. Now I'll start by checking the box for CSV has column headers and first line. And what this does is automatically maps the columns in your spreadsheet to your field values in RefTab. So I'll choose my file. This is a list of 10 assets. However, you can import hundreds and even thousands of assets at a time. So I'll choose my location that these assets will live under. I'll choose my category and I'll import these assets. Now on my locations page, I've got 10 assets imported. And notice I imported my own asset numbers as well, and all the data appears as well. Okay, so next I'll import loanees. Loanees are a list of all your end users. They are basically just a record of a person or a place or whatever you really need to use them for. And I can import a list of 10 loanees here by simply selecting my CSV file. I'll choose the box for mapping the column headers. Choose my file and I'll see them displayed, the headers will be mapped, and I can click Import. Okay, so next is where we can actually import our asset loans. So let's say I didn't want to manually check out each asset to a loanee one by one. I can actually import a list of asset numbers and loanee email addresses, and it will create all these loans in bulk. So I'll go to the settings page again, I'll click Import Export Data, and I'll scroll down to the Asset Loans Import. From here, I basically select my file and click Submit. And as you can see, each asset will be assigned to that user. So now if I go to the Loans page, I have a loan for each asset and loanee. And on the Locations page, I can also see, see that each asset is now assigned to a loanee as well. I hope this video was helpful. As you can see, it's pretty quick to set up a working RefTab account in just a few minutes. Reach out to info at reftab.com for any questions. Thank you.